What is happening guys, how you doing? Welcome to my channel guys, if you're new guys, welcome. Please make sure you hit the subscribe button and also hit the bell notification so you know when I release a video. I can't even get my words out today. So also guys, I'm gonna leave my Instagram link just down in the description box. Make sure you go follow that. And so today we are doing a reaction to all like a review basically, an online review of these Jordan ones. They're from America, they come from this young lady from uh, the West Coast. She's called Aliali May. Um, she's uh, quite involved in the fashion world, in the high-end fashion world, and she's managed to get a collaboration with Nike for these Jordan. These shoes are spectacular, nonetheless. The colorway is beautiful, simplistic colorway, but she's managed to add a couple of details. Now, with the zooms, you know they're always going to be deconstructed, which is a very good platform for her to come and pick up on and customize these shoes to her taste. So we're going to take our information today from and so yeah let's pretty much start guys so bam as you guys can see at the top there you've got this whole this deconstructed look which is happening from the tongue itself the tongue looks very thin and flimsy even the side walls which are green at the top tier there they look quite thin and a bit flimsy even the jordan the jordan look with the wings is not really a jordan um you know a logo with the wings it's got a bit of a weird material which is filled that part I love it. Even the tongue itself has got a around a blue dot. That is pretty dope. That's very unique and very customized. My my language, honestly. <laughs> so yeah, let's just scroll down and look at the side profile. That's the thing about you know the zooms, CMFTs, they are deconstructed and it's a nice look as well. Um, who else can do that better than Nike? Honestly, Nike are really killing the game right now in the resale market. As you guys can see, this shoe is dominated by the different materials. You've got the front part of the shoe, which is in... Sorry, I almost said red for some reason. I was trying to say green, you know, thinking of blue. But anyways, guys, yes, yeah, so the front part has got the blue, which wraps around the, uh, the toes. Then you've got the top part of the foot, which comes in green. And then you've got the tongue itself, which is like in an off-white color, funny enough. Then you've got the the bottom of the shoe, which is like in a white. And then you've got that hint of green from the sole just down below. And also, guys, you've got the blue laces as well. And also one thing that I mentioned before, in case you're not paying attention, you've got the A like on a stamp with a blue background. That's a nice little touch as well. But one thing I want to lead to, to, guys, is the contrast and materials. So you'll notice like um, the Nike swoosh is actually not there, but they've managed to shape the blue. So when they put it onto the shoe, you've got that like nice green silky swoosh there. So when you look at also the top tier part as you head towards the top, you've got this silky material, which is nice. But at the same time, it's a bit scary because I'm thinking of the wear and tear because it's so thin. What happens like, you know, when it gets a bit of dirt in there? But, you know, these are shoes that you don't really want to wear quite a lot. You probably like just wear once every five months, once every six months for special, you know, evenings or fashion events. Um, Yeah, there's a lot to take from this shoe. I love the design, honestly. Everything is just like bare. It's just been laid out bare as if they've stripped off like all the parts and just like just open it up just imagine like you know when you open the bonnet of a car and you see the engine there and everything is exposed this is just exactly it it tells the story of um aliali you know um based on i think um stuff that she's had to you know uh put up uh and you know wear for herself i mean la when you look at the fashion there the fashion is all about you making something your own you know whether it's just by like, you know, I don't know, doing something different or wearing something slightly different. Even if you've got to do a DIY, whether it's to, you know, cut off, you know, a part of the, say, hoodie or maybe like, you know, cut little holes in this, you know, just to make it more customizable, you'll find that people do it just to look that different and look dope. And this shoe will definitely make you look dope. It'll make you look different. It'll make you stand out. I can already see that, you know, my girlfriend can probably like wear this with like, you know, um, a black suit as well. Wear like a nice baggy black suit, you know, with a, like either a man's, do you know what? Yeah, it can work though. If she wore like um, a baggy blazer with a baggy shirt inside, maybe like a black uh, blazer with a blue like baggy shirt, right? 
wore some baggy jeans that are probably like blue and then wore these that'll be absolutely dope you know should be going for that tomboy-esque look it works man it really works whatever you want whether it's joggers or tracks or bottoms in america as you guys i think say it that way and um, this would work you know this definitely does work i like it i like it it's a shame that the guys don't really get a shoe um, so that's the inside of the shoe. So it's funny because, you know, the green part on the sides, it's actually raised, but on the inside, as you can see from the bottom there, it's an actual shoe. It's well padded, so it doesn't feel too thin or just rather strange. So you've got the Jordan Jumpman there in red with an orange inside part. I mean, the colors are so rich. They just pop in your face. I do really like these. That's your side profile there. One thing I was emphasizing was also, you know, the Jordan wing logo is not really wing logo. She's put like uh, some, I don't know, weird material there. That's a nice little touch as well. Just such little small details. Do like, you know, when you piss them together, do tell a story. So I like it. Even the back as well. I mean, look at that back. It's just, oh, the silk. That silk finish, you know, just how shiny it is. It just rounds everything off nicely. Um, that's the bottom there. So you've got the Brazilian colors there. That's a nice bottom. That's a nice bottom. So yes, guys, I mean, um, that's the little short video that I just thought I'll make about these shoes. These shoes are definitely, I think, one of the top shoes that I've seen so far this year. I like the creativity. Matter of fact, it reminds me of Off-White and some of the shoes that I've done in the past as well. Uh, I'd like to see more from uh, this girl. Um, I don't know if we should do the collection as well because she's got... I'll tell you what, guys. Let's go to the clothing collection and see what she's done. Right, so... You've got this, like, uh, basketball theme-esque or... you know, Yeah, basketball theme-esque uh, vibe. So I don't know why they've used her shoes. They've used those Jordan meets. It doesn't make sense. So ladies, you can wear this as well. That's your pleated short. You know, it looks all right, I guess. I was just bear in mind the pricing is going to be quite expensive. Uh, there's a few other items as well. I like this. This is pretty dope. This is so nice. That is nice. We used to like wear these, the Adidas ones back in the days. This is dope. And for that price as well, you'll look quite different as well. Right, let's see what else we can find. That's a nice uh, varsity jacket as well. That's pretty dope. And the pricing is not really that bad as well. And of course, you can see California there, I think. Am I correct, guys? I don't want to say the wrong state. I'll probably say the wrong state, you know. Right, let's see what else. You've also got this um, vest as well. It's a nice little vest for when you go to the gym. So she's got um, quite a big collection. I think that's about it, really. Yeah, guys, that's it, really. Just want to say thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon. Come back for the other videos that I'm going to release today. Peace. God bless. We out.